All right, what's up there guys? Slick here, back at the Slickhead Garages. Just wanna take this little moment to uh, update you on where I am with these bikes and the other projects I have going on and, and some upcoming uh, things. Um, got a new camera coming. Um, figured out how to do editing pretty good now, so the um, wrenching videos should get a little more in depth you know, do a little more editing, so that would be cool. Um, I want to uh, wire up the switch on my Ironhead Sportster project. Just going to lengthen these wires to this switch. I'm not going to bore you with all that. Just connecting them, shrink wrapping them. So, I won't bore you with that. The um, flathead... I told you I took apart the intake, took apart the seals, cleaned them all up, um, put a little oil and grease, or put grease rather, on the faces of the seals, as said in the manual. Um, took it out for a ride, and I still can't get the linker dialed in. It keeps backfiring, it's running lean. So, a, I don't know if I still have a leak or not in the intake. I sprayed it down, and I didn't hear the motor bog down. The carburetor sucked up some spray, and the motor sped up, but that's normal. Um, I finished up threading the air fitting in this uh, intake manifold leak checker. You know, you hook a regulator to an air pressure line. 2 to 5 PSI, and you'll be able to tell if your intake manifold seals are leaking before you put your carburetor all back on there to eliminate that. Um, I'm getting ready to pull the carburetor off of it and go through the carburetor if my intake is fine. I ordered new intake seals, a new intake manifold. You know, I'm trying to cover all my bases. I want to get this thing dialed in so I can start running it. Um, I want to get this switch wired up so I can put this away. I got a friend of mine's bike coming over. It's a 2007 Honda Shadow Sabre. Um, going to do tune, full tune up on it, you know, plugs, oil, uh, all his brake pads. It's getting tires put on right now. It's a buddy of mine, a uh, real close friend. His name is Large. And uh, don't make fun of him for that Honda when you see it. He used to ride a Harley, but he was in a horrific motorcycle crash, and he's lucky to be alive, and it's amazing he can even ride the Honda. He had to pick a smaller bike because he used to ride uh, Electric Glide Ultra. So. so if you're into Hondas, I'll have one in here. Um, the Roger Bourget chopper, I just got the rings for the pistons, so it's all ready to go. So I'll start putting that back together sometime this week. Um, but that's it. I won't bore you to death with this switch. It's going to be some warm weather out next week. I'll start getting some more videos pumped out. Some riding, some kicking videos. Um, got some cool upcoming events I'm going to be going to. Uh, the AMCA... Uh, swap meet out at Ole PA where my bike club is. I'll get a lot of footage at the swap meet of all the antique parts. Um, 
if you guys watch uh, the Easy Company guys on YouTube, I'll try to bump into them at the swap meet, get a little interview with them. Um, I'm going out to Wheels Through Time Museum out in North Carolina in June, so that'll be fun. I'll film something out there. But uh, that's it. I'll get back to you guys. Talk to you later.